Well, how much do you weigh? Um, or are you just going to put the box on by itself? Um, I think I'd max out your scales. You were dead on. Dead on. 20 kilos? No, 15. Oh, oh I was dead on. That was, that, that was what I was thinking. Oh, really? Yeah. Little. That's yeah. pretty good. Whew. Having disassembled my bike, boxed it up and taken it with me as checked luggage on the flight, now it's time to put it back together. This isn't something I've done before and so I don't have much experience. But for a mere $250 in excess baggage, it's certainly worth the expense. Let's see how we go. The tool I need, the one tool I need. So the bike is done, I'm going to take it out for a spin to the phone shop. Let's see if I can get myself a T Mobile sim. <clears throat> That's the plan. It is so damn hot. Right, let's do this. Let me do when I get back. It ain't possible to get a T-Mobile plan unless you have a Dutch bank account, credit card is not good enough. So I'm going to be waiting a little while for the internet, I guess. But there's other things here. But I suppose it probably takes longer than 10 minutes to get the bikes here. Maybe. One of the cooler things is that bicycle helmets aren't actually mandatory in the Netherlands for like obvious reasons. So I gave mine to Joel and he gave me his underpants. So that's probably a fair trade. My bike is, is pretty much ready to go. I'm really impressed it made it without any damage, without even just being slightly out of alignment. It's exactly how I left it and it was really easy to put together. So. There's a life skill, what I not previously had had. Super duper happy that my bike is sorted. I stressed out a lot about how I was going to get that to the Netherlands and stressed out that I had no idea what the hell I was doing. Now I'm stressing out that people are going to steal it. Uh, but overall, I'm so happy. I'm so happy that I've got it here and it's going to be great to do weekend trips away.